Now, the big battle for Uttar Pradesh has begun. India's northern state of Uttar Pradesh is going to the polls. In the first phase, more than 2 crore people in 73 constituencies in western Uttar Pradesh will cast their votes. While the Congress Samajwadi Party Alliance uh, have tightened their grip, the Uttar Pradesh elections will be a real test for Narendra Modi and the Bharatiya Janata Party, who are facing severe criticisms from the opposition for its demonetization policy. Now, elaborate security arrangements have been made in all the districts. More than 6,000 paramilitary personnel have been deployed in the 887 polling centers. The final counting of the polls will take place on March 11. Okay, well, uh, we have live visuals coming in now of uh, people uh, of the polling stations. People have uh, started to cast their votes. Uh, strategies of all, including the BJP, BSP and the Samajwadi Party Congress Alliance will be at test as 15 districts of Western Uttar Pradesh go to polls in phase one today. Uh, with the BSP fielding Muslim candidates on 18 out of 73 seats and SP Congress Alliance giving Muslim face in 12 constituencies. It is a bitter battle between the two for wooing the minority vote bank. Polling is of course being held uh, in this time it is in the Jad dominated western regions of Uttar Pradesh as well as the districts of uh, Agra, Ghaziabad and Noida. Polling will be held in 73 seats spread across 15 districts in the region. The key battles are between the Samajwadi Party, uh, Congress combined, the BJP and the BSP and the RLD. Now, the key candidates in this space include, contesting from Noida, is the son of Union Home Minister Rajnath Singh. This election is vital for Pankaj Singh as he is uh, making his debut in the Assembly polls. BJP has yet again put uh, faith in Muzaffar Nagar uh, riot-accused MLA, Sangeet Singh Som, who has been challenged by Samajwadi Party candidate Atul Chauhan and BSP's Hafiz Yaqub. Then there is Suresh Rana of the BJP. He is a controversial BJP MLA and accused in the Muzaffar Nagar riots. Uh, the Samajwadi Party has uh, fielded Lucknow University professor Sudhir Pavar against Rana. And meanwhile, BSP opted for a Muslim face, Abdul Waris uh, Khan, from this seat. Pradeep Mathur, the incumbent Congress MLA, is from Mathura. He will be challenged by BJP national spokesperson Shrikant Sharma. Mathur has been uh, winning the Mathura seat for the past three terms. Then, of course, there is L. Bajpai of the BJP, and he is contesting from Meerut. Former state BJP president and sitting M MLA Bajpai is being challenged by Samajwadi Party Congress combined Rafiq Ansari and BSP's Pankaj Jolly. Now, in the 2014 Lok Sabha polls, uh, BJP had uh, won nearly 50% of the votes uh, in this belt. It had dominated in 60 of these 73 assembly segments. Now, uh, also, let's take a quick look at the facts and figures of the 2017 Uttar Pradesh elections. The number of uh, seats in is 73 out of 404 and nearly 2.6 crore electorals. Uh, total number of candidates is 839. Total number of female candidates are 77. Total number of candidates with criminal charges are 168. 